Kenya is to also set a new eye in elections management by deploying a secure, freely accessible public portal which accurately and effectively relates fault tallings in the last elections, thereby enabling Kenyans and indeed anyone else to compare and verify tallies, thereby as a changing results, this enabled IEBC to credibly declare and certify the winners of elections and to establish before court in response to petitions by the certified candidates. That is, the elections made the constitutional choice as simple, accurate, variable, secure, accountable, and transparent. The economy was the most important of the issues on which the last election campaign was conversed because the people of Kenya, in their multitudes, made their voices heard their ideas clear and their desires known. From Busia to Banisa, Lokchogyo to Ramu, Magadi to Moyare, Mandela to Migori, and the everywhere between the people say that they wanted to transform our economic systems to democratize opportunity, enhance inclusion, and reduce exploitation. Instead of the traditional campaigns of confrontations, incitement, and divisions, the last campaign became a straight national debate on the most pertinent economic issues, affordable credit, inclusive financing, promoting and the low-cost expression of the legendary Kenyan hustling spirit for MC, MCEs and the facilitations of individual enterprise by enhancing market power through collective interventions like Chama and circles. This is how Kenyans entrepreneurs desired to secure access to credit saving markets, social security, and health insurance. By paying attention to their aspirations, we established that Kenyan entrepreneurs desire to pursue success through an inclusive market enterprise which takes positive measures to ensure that no one is left behind. The core of their aspirations comprises competitiveness anchored in collectivity as a fundamental proposition as well as strong market enterprise system that is not predatory. It is an enterprise culture which encourages the pursuit of individual aspirations through collective systems which empower every person to succeed within the context of a thriving community. In the course of consultations with the Kenyans at the, at the grassroots throughout the country, we identified a number of barriers to effective realization of the economic agenda. The first was the cost of compliance with the bureaucracy, a change in the regulation and compliance in recruiting tax administration. Secondly, the extreme informality of most enterprises, which is effectively relegated them to the margins of empowerment, facilitation, or even recognition as a low undertaking. Third, was the misconception around expanding the national tax base. Is, is it about people paying more or more people paying? The answer lies in empowering more Kenyans to enter the taxable income category through intentional effort to create millions of new jobs. Fourth, a huge number of Kenyans, around 10 million, had either been blacklisted by the Credit uh, Reference Bureau over inability to pay loans advanced to them by financial technology platforms or were struggling to pay it. Less leaders required FT securities and the vulnerable variable assets as collateral, yet these struggle, those struggling entrepreneurs required financial financing to acquire such assets in the first place. It was clear, therefore, that the preferring financing and the credit facilities were not conducive to the profitable existence of micro, small, and medium-sized enterprises. Self-employment accounts for 51.31% of all jobs in our economy. 83% or 15.3 million jobs in the informal sector and only 3.1 million jobs are in the formal sector, representing 17%. Now, considering this employment landscape, it was imperative 
that we attend to the interest of the under the served majority of workers actually sold and effectively. This engagement with the business community inspired the creation of the Financial Inclusion Fund or the Hustler Fund to eliminate the financial cost, delay the bureaucracy entailing, entailed in complying the facility employees, the latest FinTech powered by Clean Communication Corporations to get around the requirement of variable security without the risking default, the ASRO fund re-engineered the idea of collateral by deploying port, the borrower, borrower's credit score and the social capital as effective security. Without doubt, the ASRO fund has been more than transformational. It is revolutionary. It is revolutionary. Since it is enrolled on November 3rd, it has enlisted 15 million borrowers in a total of 7 million of whom are regular users dispersed a total of 29.8 billion. Hustler Fund has also enabled Kenyans hustlers to save Kenya shillings 1.5 billion. On its way to becoming effectively the biggest financial institution by the number of borrowers and the active loans, Hustler Fund also turned around the country's vintage, transforming it from an serious predatory ecosystem to a more responsible one. As a result, Kenyan's digital economy has received a tremendous shot in the arm, as demonstrated by reports that Safaricom alone has enrolled at least 2 million new subscribers in the financial ecosystem due to Hustler Fund. Today, as we celebrate progress in achieving economic economics freedom, we shall also celebrate our digital economy powered by our famous fintech community. Kenya's legendary spirit of enterprise has entered the digital space. Kenyans responded to this promise of economic freedom in an unequivocal terms. The total number of digital transactions now stands at 42.5 million through which 20.2 million Kenyans have accessed nearly Kenyan shillings, 30 billion, and repaid 19.7 billion, of which repeated customers of the Astro Fund now stands at 7 million people. Not a single shilling has been stolen through corruption, and the borrowers do not need to know anyone. Prize an official or go through complex bureaucratic procedures to access the Astro Fund facilities. They only need a device, a little airtime, and a few minutes, and they are able to get money whenever they are. The second product of the Hustler Fund will answer our unique, corrective, driven, competitive market enterprise to the online domain. To promote inclusion, Astro Fund is going to deploy collective to the help enterprise overcome exclusion and the barriers to participation in credit, savings and social security, health insurance and other socio-economic amenities. We are therefore committed to leveraging FinTech in ensuring that no one is left behind in the financial and entrepreneurial in inclusivity revolution. This is how we will use policy and technological innovation to mainstream our way of life. Competitive entrepreneurs, Saya Mr. Afu, end of this month, and the chief to Nakutakia Zot about to find an eye cast the best of luck. Mabo Mawili. Kenya Badu, the Mzen Takohapa, and the Shkuru Sana Pamim Kubewe Fusa, Sukri, the Sukri Muhimu Sana to Madaraka Kenya Mbae, and I shall recover in Kenya Yoti. And by the Sukri Muhimu Sana, but to me, you buy an eight of a Shuja, a Bodisha, my Shayao, Ili Wapigane, it is easy to wear to bat the Wesa Kujitawala. Whoever learned to talk of Serkali, Lazima to Mamukumbuke Hawa, whoever to Rampa Mungu by Metukisha, but to repeat of Kamimengi of Wamengesha, Yasi and Mekwa Wing, Ileki to Ingefa Kutatuan in Yasi, what to a church of the Kutabu Choba, when it acquires a Kupa Sana. In Yasu Kujapa Murefu Sana, Zaiki Chomeka, the Choma in Manyata Yote, Inje, when you make it the Chomeka. Whoever made I miss our Nenji was Chome Yonyasi. Kila mtu atekea siara istupe kwa parapara na wale watu naenda safari wana piga chai kwa parapara na watu ya makaa kujahadari kwa hiyo nyasi 
Wakaitana mulio na ishini ya tulipitia Wahayo machacha na seba set sana Shukra mbanachema kwenye kukwa kwenye batia fursa hii Thank you very much Na sometime inafika kiwango mwana seba Kuwacha serekali ifanya Serekali ni yinyi Mambo mengi mwana rusa kwa dizi Mambo mengi mwana rusa kwa security yangu timu Iko mambo mengine ambao tutawisisa nyinyi Security of this sub-county inategemea nyinyi Niko na umbi moja From the grassroot level Tuko na chiefs na village administrators Make use of this people Patie ni ambari so that ituone hile tunajunga nyinyi Sisi tumetoka ambari Atuna shamba hapa All of us Kukioni wanaukoto ya meka hapa Tumetoka ambari we should not take it lightly. Kwacha tuchunge misitu yetu. Na sanikoshine ya kwamba county government si waoni hapa. Let us be serious with our duties, not government officials. Village administrator, water administrator, support administrator, first consider this national duty. We were employed to work. Here, we were employed to work. Here, we were employed to work. Let us take our work seriously. It's not good. I'm having a meeting with the officials from the county government, the national government, the city, the city, we harmonize for now we work. And that's a serious matter that has called us to work and have a meeting. Kuna mitu gine ndogo ndogo, ya wato nasikia chakuli mekuja, mepolwa, meendo na muna hii, gavara na piga simu, nini. Let us have one of the work. Na inansia to saa hii. I wish all of them were here. When my students are here, I expect the village administrators, all of them to the county officials who are present so that we celebrate together this national day. The salon will talk. Informally, and Mambo ya Usalama video ni mesema, inategemea nyingi. Give us information. Sisi tuko tayari, kutumia yu information ambao muda tupatia. Usalama wa hii boda yetu na Somali, na ndani ndani, inategemea nyingi. I thank anyone ambao na tupatia pali, tutaitumia video na takikana. Kwa ya machache, na watakia mema, and the best of luck. Asante ni sato.